guys you are welcome back to lydia tv show it's your girl lydia as you all know so i want to say thank you very much to all my returning subscribers and please if you're new here and you like what i do please subscribe and support me turns on the notification button so that whenever i upload new videos you'll be the first to be updated so guys today's video is all about Nora brown and our ex Cameroonian footballer female by name gael so guys before i get there please i would like to advertise my business you know i do business i'm doing into fashion so please if you want to buy something that you want to wear you know it's for it's christmas coming i have a lot of things that i sell so i do wholesale and i do retail and shipping worldwide please do support me by buying other anything that you want we have dresses shoes uh, suit anything that you want that is wide right away from turkey these are some of the samples that i'm showing you guys like this so whatever thing that you want that you like you can follow me on facebook elidia label you can even on instagram as lydia tv show i post most of the things that i sell there i have a lot of things guys good ones quality classic so if you need anything from turkey please first of all write me contact me so that we can do business we can talk and also guys we are for kids we have ladies we have men so i have for all the genders whether you are a man you're a woman and you want to buy for your kids your girlfriend your boyfriend please don't forget to contact me i got a lot of stuff and i will send you a lot of pictures behind the scene now let's go to what brought us here this is Nora brown and stephanie there's a little bit of little misunderstanding that went between them on social media. Nora Brown called out for Stephanie. Who is Stephanie? She is the ex-girlfriend of Clementon. And we know Clementon, right? He's one of the biggie, uh, the, the one of the contestants in the biggie studio, the 237 biggie studio. So she is the ex-girlfriend of Clementon in the biggie studio. So guys. Nora Brown went to her timeline and heard that some particular gay day inside Blue Abway it be turned towards Clement now because of nigga dump you. I don't decontrol myself. Bitch, I know you will see this message. Watch out before I expose you. All those your funny reaction to things that don't consent you. Be very careful. I am not a happy bunny anymore. See guys, this is the message Nora Brown took to a girl. Her name is Stephanie. So... After that, Stephanie went to her own timeline, young Stephanie. She also said, the next time you want to talk about me, Nora Brown, tag me with your dirty... Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> My people, in fact, eh, this is the message for you guys. So, there's, you know, YouTube now is very hard. We don't pronounce something. After the little saga that they have done on social media, this one has insulted this one, this other person has gone and replied and insulted, just like that for the past few days now, guys. Ha. Today morning, I want to see the girl has entered the inbox of Nora Brown and apologize until they have sent her a sum of 50k. So, at least it is good that she came out and apologized. So, for me, I don't, I don't encourage disrespect. This girl is too young to be dragged on social media. She is too very young to have quarrels with an elder person, a mother, someone who can be like a mother. So I'm very happy that she came back to her senses and finally apologized to Nora Brown. You know, Nora Brown always does have plenty of sarcasm for the social media. So it didn't make itself clean and just mesmerize her anyhow. But anyway, we turned the head of state. <laughs> okay, guys, now let's go to what brought us here. Ex-Cameroonian footballer and female national team manager in Anga. In and Ganamon Gael has just been discovered to be a girl girl things, eh? a lesbian, after numerous suspicions from Cameroonian sport lovers. So, my people, many people have been suspecting this lady, oh, but finally, it has just burst so, until there are various sex tapes and videos on her and uh her -huh, doing her things with her partner all over the internet. So, many people have been saying that, oh my god, so this girl is like that, she's doing woman to woman things and so on and so forth. So, guys, due to this viral thing, some bloggers have been doing what we call pasha, 
he put, he put on this case. Until people are saying that if it was a man, they would have crucified the man on internet. But because it's a lady now, they are just doing hippo, hippo, and eh? hippo, hippo bloggers, hypocrite. So, guys, this is really terrible that it has actually leaked, but it was private. I don't know who uh, the ex girlfriend bought it out. So, guys, she had a problem with her ex girlfriend, they break up, and from the news we gathered it's her ex-girlfriend that bought it out on social media see this phone and internet go do not for our generation no guys it's really terrible that after a breakup you just have to expose another woman that is just like you on social media it's terrible so now when the incident happened guys we have a lot of people that have been talking about these things on social media that oh we should not forget our culture we Africans, we don't know such things. We don't know why we are copying such things from the foreign land. Even if we are there, we should learn to maintain our culture. So guys, uh, Gael now went and put a law case to one girl that is called Ahada Nomo Brenda. That she's having her things in her house. Very expensive things like jewelries, dresses tablet like was it ipad and important documents that are in her possession so she saw she so had to court to release her things to her and now she also resigned guys she also resigned from the team after the you know guys when these kind of things always leak out you have a lot of things that you lose is someone like uh, ty you know she lost almost four brand deals so uh Gaia thought that since it has released maybe it's going to bring out a problem that for her to like be disgraced publicly let her just now or now you withdraw herself from the team so now she's no longer a footballer in the Cameroon team so she decided that eh, that now you guys should disgrace me like that eh, i should better resign that is how she definitely she resigned from the national team and now we don't yet know if there's any information that will be again i'm going to bring it guys i'm going to bring it back to you guys so guys after this incident took place now brenda bia which is she has a page called brie magazine so she went to her timeline and she wrote force a bond courage which means she's encouraging <laughs> this action so my main problem now was the comment section, guys. You know, we always love to read comment section. There was a lot of badging comment section of Brenda Bia. Some even went off topic. Some were just badging on her and giving all kinds of things, insulting her and her father. You know, her father is the president of Cameroon. So everything eh, can happen you know, just because you are a celebrity. Anything can happen. So let's read some of the comments that people wrote under her. Melozy Prince said, your family must leave Cameroon for a while. The country needs to be alone to think better about the loss of your father. <laughs> oh, guys, this is my brother, actually. They comment, hey, guys, let's continue. So there was a lot of positive and negative comments, but let's first of all go with this other one. This one says she's destroying such a beautiful girl's life and, and she still has honor for this really my country so this other person is like surprised that they have given this girl honor another person says stop uh, really stop lots i'm lost a girl spend her time lapping her daughter <laughs> and she's called asia and she's and she's called like to be say asia me as a mother she can die you know many people have like pity for her and some people are saying that they let her go and die you may go quarrel now it is safe Another person say, leave the people, Brenda. You already want to disturb. Good luck to what? So you encourage bullshit like this? We have kids that need a good education. So these are some of the comments that people have been blasting on Brenda due to this post that she make by encouraging our footballer our female footballer on such acts. Now guys, other people were like encouraging her too. So so this Thierry Carroll also said that I don't have to judge you with your privacy. It's just your, it's just your, by the way, it's just yours, by the way. A lot of courage to you, dear lioness. Take care of yourself, especially remember that our common enemy is the devil and he's roaming around. Keep safe. So many people are encouraging why others are blasting. 
So guys, these are one of the things that have been happening now. People are blasting while others are uh, encouraging her. Some people say we shouldn't judge. But guys, whatever thing that comes on social media or whatever thing that is out, guys, people will always talk about it and judge you. No matter what, even as the Bible says we shouldn't judge, there are people that will still judge it. So let's just be cool okay so guys i really i really can't put the pictures and everything here because of youtube policy even if it is blur they are going to take put a question mark on my video so this is the latest guys please thanks for watching <laughs>